You know, um, Alice Mann died on Christmas Day. Can you hear me? God rest her soul. She was a good friend of yeah. mine. Yeah. Yes, she was a I good mean, friend of mine. I, I knew she was, George, and I can remember at the um, Iraq war debate, she was the only woman MP in Parliament that actually spoke against it. And uh, I, I yeah. had great admiration for her. She was in her 80s, and she was a very special person. You know? Um, she was 85. Uh, she was a former nurse. Uh, she was an activist in the Nurses' Union, as was then, NUPI, the National Union of Public Employees. She came into Parliament as a working-class champion, as the salt of the earth, and she proved to be one of the most assiduous parliamentarians that I sat with over the nearly three decades I sat in the House. She was a gem, an absolute jewel of a woman. Uh, she, of course, as you say, opposed the Iraq war, the Afghan war, uh, but uh, perhaps more, with more difficulty. She was one of a hardy band of us that opposed the Yugoslav war in 1999. And she did it with such courage and conviction when there were only a few of us uh, who withstood the propaganda. At least by the time we got to Iraq in 2003, there were a lot of us, uh, Norma. But in the Yugoslav war, there was only Mr. Ben, our leader, uh, me, Alice, uh, and uh, Jeremy Corbyn, and a few others that opposed that war. Even Ken Livingston supported the Yugoslav war. Michael Foote supported it. Mark Seddon supported it. Tribune supported it. We were a hardy bunch, and Alice was one of the hardiest of us. Over to you, Norma. No, the funny thing is, Joe, I, I totally agree. I was quite upset when I read about that, although she's lived a long life. And the funny thing is, um, if you ever saw me, I actually, she looked a bit like me. Every time I see her face, I think, gosh, she doesn't have to look like me. <laughs> well, let's hope we'll all get together again on the other side, Norma, uh, because if there's a heaven, Alice Mann will definitely be in it. And let's hope you and I get past the pearly gates. Thanks uh, very much for the call.